Good morning. Welcome. It's Kelly again for Wellness Wednesday. We're back in the yoga studio. Last week, we did something called box breathing, and we used it with the four Bs so that when our mind is going out of control, we can take the reins back, take control, and feel good in our head space and in our heart space. So quick reminder, let's welcome our body and take a big breath. Reach all the way up. Breath. Hold on to one wrist and go to one side. Hand lift and take the other wrist going to the other side. Big breath. Maybe lean back over your chair. Don't fall. Big stretch. And then come back and grab a seat. Okay. The four Bs. Do you remember what they are? Let's do them together. Maybe this morning was wild. Your brother stole your thing. Your sister said something nasty. The world is a disaster and you can't focus for school. So let's put on the brakes. Press your hands together. Whatever it is you don't want a lot of, squash it. Squeeze. No anxiety today. SOLs are around the corner if they're not already here. No stress. Squish, squish, squash. Press. Let all that extra energy that's just flying around your body press out of your hands. So put on the brakes. Take one more breath and let go. <sighs> Let's do box breathing. Inhale to four. Hold. Breathe out and hold to notice. One more time, breathe in and hold. Breathe out and hold to notice. Are you clenching your jaw? Are you tightening your shoulders? Let's do one more just for good measure. Last one, hold, breathe out. And feel the calm. Okay. So box breathing is important. Let's give our brain a message. Taking your fingers, tap them on your forehead. I'm going to have a great day. Come to your temples. I'm going to have positive thoughts that come into my mind. Come to your cheekbones, a gentle tap. I'm going to smile. Smiling makes other people smile. Let's smile a lot. Come to your jaw, gentle down your neck, to your collarbones, and right here at the heart. I love myself unconditionally. I love myself because I am a good person and I accept myself for who I am right now. You can place a hand on heart on belly or your hands on your thighs and just take two more quiet breaths. And let your body receive that message. Nice, okay. Let's move a little today, what do you say? So we're in our seat. Scooch back so you don't hit your table on your hit your head on the table or hit your friends, just a little space. Let's take our hands down by our side. Let your fingers reach down for the ground, but imagine your skeleton growing even longer. Fingers reach down, palms reaching forward. This is called seated mountain pose. So as your fingers reach down, imagine your feet pressing down into the ground like a tree. Root shooting down your feet, root shooting down of your fingers, but the crown of your head is reaching for the sun. So how long can you make your body be? Take a breath. <sighs> nice. Reach your arms all the way up. Big breath. We're going to bring our hands back behind us. Interlace your fingers. So clasping your hands together behind your back, bring them over to one side. Mine is over to my left. Left elbow is off to the side. Sit tall. Take a breath. As you exhale, left ear finds left shoulder. Pause here for a breath or two. And while you're here, notice the right side, the opposite side of your neck. Maybe your chin drops slightly towards your shoulder or you lift your eyes up to the sky. Nice. Take a breath. As you breathe out, let your hands come back. Release, lift all the way up. Big breath up. Grab all the good things. And then your hands come back behind you. And release your fingers. Bring it over to the right side. Right elbow off to the side. Take a breath, grow long. And then right ear to right shoulder. And what do you notice on the left side of our neck? A lot of times our head spins because we're worried about the past or we're worried about the future. But just stay here right now. Take a breath and notice right now. How does your neck feel right now? As you breathe out, let your fingers drop and come off to the side. Find a little shoulder shrug, a little dance, a little pretty. And let's find our legs. So let's take our right leg, lift it up, hold your knee in towards your body. And you can rotate your ankle around a few times, made it cricks and crackles. 
And then take your ankle and cross it over your knee. So for some people, this hip is very tight. If it's tight, you can maybe lessen, take your left leg over to the side, take your right hand to your knee, gently press it down, flex your foot, and then give your shins and your calves a little massage. Thank you, legs. You help me walk. You help me run. You help me dance. Maybe not dance very well. Dance, move, enjoy this life. Take one more breath. And then let that leg cross all the way over. Left hand to the outside of your right leg. Right hand can come to the top of your chair or the base of your seat. But as you breathe and let that grow, your spine grow tall. And then as you exhale, twist. Look all the way behind you over your right shoulder. One more breath. And then come back to center. Ah, nice. Take your leg off. Let's switch sides. Hello, left leg. Hug it in. Find space in your ankle. And then cross that ankle over your right leg. So sit tall, pressing the left hand gently on the left knee. Your hip might be like, uh-uh, this feels tight. You don't have to do so tight. If it feels good, if the sensation feels good, let it be a place to release. A lot of our emotions we hold, our anger we hold in our hips. So that can be a place that you let go of. And then squeeze your shins, squeeze your calves. Thank you, legs. Thank you, ankles. Sometimes we're in a bad mood. If we just start saying thank you for things and we're not in such a funk, you know? So take one more breath here, press. And then as you exhale, let that leg cross all the way over. Right hand comes to the outside of the knee. Left hand behind you. Sit tall as you breathe in. And as you exhale, look over your left shoulder. Take another breath. Ah, come back to center, uncross your legs. Take your hands behind you. I'm gonna turn sideways so you can see. Interlace your fingers behind your back. As you breathe in, let the knuckles reach all the way down. Take a big breath here and exhale, hinge forward from the hips. And you can stay here or let the knuckles lift up off the low back. Maybe your back cracks. Shake your head no and yes. And then slowly come up. Lift your hands to the sky. Take a big breath, maybe a little micro bend at the top. <sighs> How does that feel? Congratulations. You just did some yoga today. You breathed, you moved into your body. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. And don't forget, be kind to yourself. You do make this world a better place. So you deserve to feel good in your body and in your mind. I'll see you next Wednesday. Namaste.